hello guys hope you are fine in this video we will see very important shortcut keys from a to z which we can use while using a desktop or pc before we begin if you are new to this channel please fastly subscribe by pressing the subscribe button below and press the bell button next to it if you don't want to miss any future notifications okay guys so coming to our shortcut keys uh, our shortcut key number one is control plus a Yes, guys, it's control plus A. If you want to select all, it's like all the text which is written. If you want to select all, you have to press control plus A. Let's check it out. Let's press control plus A. Yes, guys, everything got selected. And our another shortcut key is control plus B. Yes, guys, uh, this is used if you want to make any text alphabet, whichever is whatever is written, if you want to make that into bold. Yes, guys, let's check it out. Let's try to check this. Let's press Ctrl plus B. Yes, guys, you can see that letters got bold. And again, if we press the same thing again, it will get non bold. Let's press Ctrl plus B. Yes, guys. And uh, another shortcut key is Ctrl plus C. That is used to copy any text. Let's check it out. Mm, let's try to copy this now. Let's press Control plus C and uh, to cop to paste. Let's paste now Control plus V. Yes, guys, you can see same thing got copied. And uh, our another shortcut key is Windows plus D. Yes, guys, it's Windows plus D. Uh, this is used to minimize or maximize your open files. Like uh, you can see, this file is open. If you want to minimize it and if you don't want to use a mouse you can press windows plus d uh, let's check it out let's press windows plus d yes guys it got minimized and again if you want to open the same files you can press again windows plus d here it is and another shortcut key is control plus f if you want to find anything in this page or in this document you have to press control plus f that is a shortcut key. Let's check it out. It's control plus F. Let's check it out. Let's press control plus F. Yes, guys. Uh, now let's try to check uh, uh, the word find in this document. F I N D find. Yes, you can see one match. There's one. And that word got highlighted here. It's control plus F for that thing. And our another shortcut key is Control plus I. That is used if you want to make any alphabet into italic. Let's check it out. Control plus I. Let's try to press this. Control plus I. Yes, guys, you can see the text got changed into italic. Let's make it to normal again and press Control plus I. Yeah, here it is. Yes, guys, if you want to open a new document, you have to press Control plus N. Let's check it out control plus n control plus n you can see here guys a new document has got open of the same type what we are using earlier so it's control plus n if you want to print this page you have to press control plus p it's control plus p will ask you if you want to print this or not and uh, <clears throat> now another shortcut key is control plus s if you want to save this document you have to press control plus s let's check it out control plus s and yes our document got saved and it will ask you if you want to save this with what name so whatever name you want you can enter that and save it here and another shortcut key is control plus u that is used to underline any word. Let's check it out. It's Control plus U. Yes, guys, and it got underlined. If you want to remove the underline, you have to press the same thing. Control plus U. Yes, guys, and Control V as said above. You have to if you want to paste anything which you have copied or cut, you have to press Control plus V. Like we copied the things earlier. This Control plus C, and if you want to paste the same thing, you have to press Control plus V. It got copied here. And another our shortcut key is 
control plus w if you want to close this document you have to press control plus w and it will ask if you want to save or if you want to just close it without save and another shortcut key is control plus x that is used to cut let's check it out let's press control plus x and that thing got cut and if you want to paste it somewhere you have to press and control plus v and another shortcut key is control plus y now if you feel what Whatever mistakes you had done, you want to get back the same things. If you had, I will tell you. If uh, let's okay. Before that, we'll understand uh, the next shortcut key, and then we'll come back to this. Uh, it's Control plus Z. Now, uh, just imagine if you erase this one letter. If you feel it was by mistake, and uh, you feel no, 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 that actually was not a mistake, and you wanted that to be there. You have to press Control plus Z. And again, after sometimes you feel no, no, no. Actually, you were right. It was a mistake itself. Then again, to remove that alphabet, you have to press Control plus Y, and that thing will go away. So Control plus Y and Control plus Z are used to redo and undo. Uh, redo is uh, in simple terms to repeat what was done earlier. Yeah, to repeat Control plus Y. Control plus Y, Control plus Y, Control plus Y. So whatever the next last performed uh, function we had performed, it will repeat the same thing again. And Control Z is uh, undo to go back to the previous step. To go back, like uh, we had performed all these functions. If you don't want to perform all these functions, you have to again press Control plus Z. Yes. And our next shortcut key is Shift plus Arrow. To select uh, any alphabet so it's like we are here we have to if you press shift and the left arrow it will get selected so see I'm not using the mouse now if you want to select uh, if you don't want to select so much if you want to go backwards again you have to press control plus the left arrow and another shortcut key is control plus enter uh, if you want to add one more page i mean to say one more blank page in this document you have to enter control plus enter let's check it out let's press control plus enter okay same thing now got added in sorry uh, new pages got added here uh, let's check it out let's come here let's press control plus enter yes guys uh, we could have written here also but still as we get a function to open in uh, new page the new page has got opened and another shortcut key is function plus f12 that is used for save as uh, it's function plus f12 let's check it out function plus f12 it will ask you save as what type of document uh, here it is above you can see save as save as and uh, these were the shortcut keys uh, which we use on daily basis on laptop or pc so make a note of it and try to use this often and you will be the master of keyboard thank you guys